Today on The Boot Guy, we are looking at the Tate Chugga by Alan Edmonds. So one of the beautiful things about this chugga is just the actual physical weight of it because Alan Edmonds chose to use this ultra light sole. Now this is an extremely soft sole. I mean this thing is super soft. It is soft like that for a reason because what they're trying to do is they're trying to build a casual boot that you're going to wear more often than anything else. Now the soft sole, the first thing that's going to come to mind is it's not going to be very durable and they're not. Soft soles never are and they're not extremely long wearing. But something like this in a boot that is completely recraftable and resolable, after you burn through that sole, you can have a new one put on. Now I'm not going to say you're going to burn through that thing in the first year or the second year, but eventually it's going to happen more so than a harder sole shoe. And with this tape being super comfortable because of this soft kudos suede, yeah, that's right, it's kudos suede. At first I didn't understand what kudo meant either until I started to investigate it. Now I can remember those old nature programs I watched when I was younger and seeing the kudo as being kind of like an antelope and sure enough, Kudo suede, it's an exotic material. It's an exotic leather from Africa. It's a Kudo antelope. It's beautiful, the hand of it, the softness of it, just the way it finishes, just the way the nap moves back and forth is just purely outstanding. Now, like I said, it's recraftable, resolable, so eventually you're going to want to put on a new sole and this boot is going to be perfect. Leather line, pour on leather insole. So when you send this thing back to Allen Edmonds for a new sole and you're picking out what type of sole you want, they're probably going to juice up the inside too because more than likely than not, with these beautiful chugga boots, what you're going to end up doing is you're going to end up wearing these without socks in the summertime because the boots just that lightweight enough. Now, it might carry you through the winter and you might really like it in the colder months, but it's those warmer months. It's those months when you want to really get out there and move around and walk around that the Tate is really going to take hold and it's going to shine through. Now, they manufactured this on their number 42 last. Now, the 42 last is one of my favorites because it gives you a little bit more room up through here right through the ball of the foot right into the toes you get a lot more room in there so being a wider foot guy that I am I really like the way this feels it also has a very nice tight heel cup because most of the time when you have a really wide foot you have a narrow heel it just seems to be the way those things work out so this boot fits really good for those types of people now I said it was leather lined and it is check that out inside it's a full beautiful glove leather inside there it's super soft and even the pour on insole has a leather liner on top of that so it just becomes a very cool comfortable boot that just has a very nice fit and because of the kudos suede and the leather lining eventually this thing takes on a memory in your foot and becomes exceptionally comfortable only to you now, I don't think I need to mention it, but I'm going to say it anyway. Handcrafted in the USA, built in Wisconsin. So that means there's a lot of love and care that goes into building these boots. Even when you start looking at the details, like the detail back in the heel section, the stitching, the very fine stitching. Usually in boots, we see really thick, heavy, very thick stitching. The stitching that comes around here in these detail parts is more like what you would find in a very fine dress shirt. It really shows through. It really shows a talented hand that made those lines. Now about the size and the fit on this beautiful tape boot, I have to say for the first time in a long time, I found an Allen Edmonds to run a little big. Usually Allen Edmonds on my feet, spot on. But having this in my size, I really wish I would have went down a half size smaller because I'm probably going to wear something like this more often in the warmer months, which means I'm going to wear thinner socks. So if I'm wearing thinner socks, if I'm wearing these in the warmer months, I might want it to fit a little bit tighter. So if you're running out to buy a pair, if you're going to order a pair, if you have the chance to try on your size and a half size down, bring some extra socks with you, bring your regular everyday cushion socks, whatever you wear, but also bring a pair of lightweight summer socks, not necessarily ankle socks, thinner wool socks, nylon dress socks, whatever you wear in the summertime and try on all those sizes.
So that's the Tate by Alan Edmonds, this beautiful chug a boot in this Kudo exotic suede. Hey, if you currently own anything from the Allen Edmonds company, please comment below and let guys know what it is you like about them, what it is you don't like about them. Also, please, if you have any pictures of you and your Allen Edmonds, please remember on Instagram, you can post those pictures. Use the hashtag TheBootGuyReviews so that we can all see which model of the Allen Edmonds you are wearing. Hey, if you want to see some detailed photos of the Tate, if you want to see the inside, the outside, if you want to know more about the last numbers, how they work in reference to your foot, or if you just want to know more about the boot in general. Swing by to bootguy.com. There I'll have photographs, I'll have a blog posting, and I'll have a bunch of other information about the Tate just waiting for you. Hey, please don't forget to hit my subscribe button below. It really helps out. And remember, if you're on Instagram or Twitter all day long, I find interesting boots like this. I take interesting photos and I get it out there so we can have some interesting conversations. Hey, if you're about to pick up a pair of these Allen Edmund Tates and you got some questions about size, fit, about the care on this beautiful suede, or if you just really want to know more about the ultralight sole, is it really a good sole for you depending on what you plan on doing in this beautiful chugga? feel free to shoot me over an email. All right, until the next time, I'm the Boot Guy. Thanks a lot for watching.